Alright guys, welcome back. This is Vapon back with another game of League of Legends. Now, this is gonna be the f It's not League of Legends, what am I saying? This is StarCraft 1, Brood War Important, StarCraft 2, what a dumbass now. This is the remake, as you may be aware. We're gonna be doing Mission 5 of the Queen of Blades campaign. Let's jump straight into it. Now, this mission is called True Colors. It's at the outskirts of Augustgrad early morning. In the early morning. Now, this mission is a bit sneaky. We have to do some interesting things here. And uh, it's a very difficult mission. I've already tried to record this once and I failed miserably. I did really well in the start, but then later on, they just started overwhelming me because, you know, they start attacking with bigger and bigger forces. And there's one mistake that I did, and I'll talk about it on the next loading screen. We'll go into the briefing first. So uh, let's get into that as soon as it starts loading. Finishes loading, I mean. League of Legends, my ass. This ain't no League of Legends. Cerebro, Duran, the time has come to separate the chaff from the wheat. Now that the UEJ's power base is broken on this world, only their forces on Char pose any significant threat to me. It's time to move to the second phase of my plan. And what of your allies here in Korhal, my queen? What would you have done with them? They are of no further use to me. Though they have proven themselves useful, it might be dangerous to allow them to live. Without the services of General Duke, Minx will be easy to deal with. But Raynor and Phoenix are uncannily resourceful. <sighs> they must all be eradicated. Cerebrate, I want both General Duke's and Phoenix's bases destroyed. Leave no one alive. My queen, if I may suggest a strategy. Both the Protoss and Terran forces are resting after our previous victory. If we attack immediately, while most of them are asleep and unaware, we can whittle down their defenses with relative ease. Clever. How long after our initial attack can we expect them to regroup and retaliate? I'd say in six minutes. That only gives us enough time to launch a surprise attack against one base, but it is a sound plan. Wrong. Sir, feel free to launch your initial attack against either base. Failure is not an option. Slaughter them all in my name. Right, the thing here is to destroy one base. What I'm gonna do is I'm going to cripple all of the bases, or at least a few of them. Now, as I said, there is no easier and harder mode. There is only hard and insane mode. I'm gonna be doing on the hard mode because the scripting is very, very good. I mean, not the scripting. The AI is very, very strong compared to what it was in Brood War. So this mission is very difficult. Hopefully it'll work out as I planned. Now, this bit is not important, so let's just uh, ignore that for now. Um, basically, what I'm going to do is I'm going to destroy their resource income. And I tried this the first time. It doesn't work as well as I thought because for some reason, even if they have no resource income, they still end up having full amount of units being created. It, it's like a, a computer cheating thing, you know, so that they, they get free units, basically. That's a lot of uh, quotes from StarCraft 1. Uh, so what I'm going to do is, not only am I going to destroy the uh, the mineral line, I'm also going to destroy some of the more important uh, ground, sorry, air buildings. Uh, these air buildings are the basically the air production facilities for the Terran and the Protoss. Both of them are very dangerous and they caused me so much problem. I lost a ridiculous amount of resources trying to defend against carriers and, and groups of rates. Uh, they usually end up sending about two carriers and maybe three or four, uh, what are they called? Oh, I can't remember. Scouts, that's what they're What's called. Up? And when How they send uh, raids, they send about six or seven of them. And it's just a bit too much to handle after a while. You kind of run out of minerals and I really could not take over another base because they just kept destroying the hatchery there. So I'll grab these guys and that guy. They will come down here to this base. I will grab another one, and he will come to this base. Then I will grab the Zerglings, and they will go to this base. And then I will grab this guy, and I will bring him to this base.
Now, every bit of buildings that you destroy is quite important, and the faster you do it, the better. That's why I actually done it before even setting my drones to mine or anything. Oh, I forgot about this as well. Shit. Oh, these guys are already busy. Alright, so destroy the probes for starters. And then we need to destroy the Nexus. Oh shit, where's my hydrolysis? Okay, they're there. Alright, there is a thing there, so I'll put you guys here. I'll put you right here. That way he can attack all of these guys. Now this will cripple this side. Now these guys need to go here. Shit. This guy needs to be placed quite perfectly because otherwise he gets taken up by the turret. I think this is the perfect way to place him. No, I don't think I'll be able to get the carriers, unfortunately. I think they're slightly out of position. But um, I should be able to get this done right now like this. Now I have still two... almost three minutes. So... Everything should technically go okay. Now, the air units here are destroyed. The resources here are destroyed. Actually, you better kill that. Ah, oh, you can't kill it. Can I attack here? Damn it, I cannot attack here. Right. Now, this base is pretty much destroyed. There's nothing that they can build out of this base. Uh, except for actually, hold on, they can still build from here. Now I'll try to end this mission as quickly as possible. I'm still gonna have two bases attacking me. Uh, well, this one is not actually, but they will have the production facilities here, so that is a bit of a problem. And then the other problem is going to be the top left base, but I'll destroy that probably pretty early on in the game. Now I'll set three workers to go on gas. Shit, why are these guys here? And yeah, yeah, overlords. Shit. That's not supposed to happen. Fuck me. Oh, no. Ah, oh, that went really bad. I screwed that up pretty badly. Alright, 14 seconds until that's destroyed. Very good. Now I still have to deal with the Protoss, which is a little bit problematic. Continue your attack, Cerebrid. Their defenses won't last long against us. Right, I think I did okay. Considering... The, uh, the fact that this base is completely useless now, they have absolutely no production. They do have one gateway up here, which I'm not too scared about, I'll destroy that pretty soon. This base is completely shut down, I'm not even sure why those workers are not working, to be honest. Probably because I've been terrorizing them. Oh shit, they have a scout here. But this Nexus is destroyed, so that's pretty useless. Uh, they do have one, two, and three, four production shit see there's rates and these guys are coming from here so this will have to go first I wonder can I sneak this guy over because he's kind of useless right now anyways now let's see e damn it almost 
Oh Jesus, these guys are starting to attack a lot, holy shit. Oh shit, they're actually attacking quite a lot right now. Shit, 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 shit. That's what happened last time. The a lot of anti-air, or anti-ground, I mean. Oh, and the nuclear launch as well. They seem to have been bugged though. They didn't really seem to be doing that much to me with that. Anyways, so that is good. Right, so that was pretty much the hard bit, surviving the first attack. I wasn't quite ready for it, I expected it to be a little bit more easy to handle, but it wasn't too horribly bad. Now, the more bases I destroy, the faster the better, obviously, because I will get less attacks thrown at me. I need to also get anti-air and a lot of it, because these guys are not going to let up. They're just going to keep spamming me with units. The more defense buildings I have, the better. Alright, that's good. I need to get a queen's nest. Oh, shit, no, I don't want that. Now, the thing I'm worried about with the, um, the Protoss mostly is actually... Uh, what are they called? Air units. They send carriers and scouts, which is a big, big problem for me. Oh, yeah, yeah, overlords. I need to start destroying these things. Oh my god, holy shit. Another attack. Oh, tell me they don't have Reavers there. I think they do. Nope, they don't. Now I'm gonna build another hatchery. Because I need it. The reason I'm building the hatchery is because I need to build a lot of servings right now. And just rush one of the... Uh, one of the bases. Let's try to take out this. This is a big problem right now. What is that? I also need to have a lot of hydralisks ready all the time. Where's the other building I was building? Oh, there they are. Now this needs to get destroyed ASAP. Uh, you too need to turn into lurkers. Now I do have a third hatchery now. Which is good. Let's get a load of hydralisks. And I'll get a spire as well, because the spire is pretty useful right now. Oh wait, no, is that a lair only? Yeah, no mind. It's correct. Oh shit. I didn't expect to get that right now. Oh, that thing cleaned up. Fuck me sideways. Not expect to have a reaver right there now. How are my minerals doing? Only about 900 left, so I do need to get this rolling. Now, I'd like to get mutilisk production as well, that would be pretty handy right now. 
think my defenses should hold. Oh shit! Ah, oh, damn it! I need to get me a uh, hydrous movement. And once this is done, I'm also going to be getting ultralisks. They are going to be ridiculously important for me right now. More Zerglings! If I can destroy the production from this thing, that would be pretty handy. See, they even built a Phoenix already. Or not a Phoenix, a Dragoon. That'll hold. Evolution complete. Now there's minerals there, so I could take that over essentially, but I will actually need to um we require more Vespine gas. Oh god. Forgot about how much these cost. Ginger's the unit appear, right? Oh Jesus. Fuck it, just fight him. The high cost is under attack. That's alright, I'll hold him. Fuck it, just kill it, it's gonna kill one of the fucking spark colonies. Our forces are under attack. Really? Why do I have these here? Alright, you can convert to a lurker. Um, let's get Ultralisk, Zerg, Zerg. Zerg, 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 Zerg. I need to get Carapace as well. I do have an Ultralisk on the way here, so that's good. Now this guy will be a pretty good tank for now. Let's go. Now if I can destroy this, and actually I don't really need to put apply, apply pressure here, I'm gonna hold off for a sec. I have to take over this top base. Or hell no, I'm gonna just do that with, um... What are they called? Needless. Here, why do I do that? All of you, send them here. The hive cluster is under attack. That'll hold, no problem. As you can see, the Terrans just absolutely have no damage at all. They just don't do anything to me. And that is very good. Which means if I can if I can capture this base, I shouldn't be having to deal with too much damage. Now you go first. Shit. I don't see these things. I always see nuclear launches, but I, I can never see where they are. So I don't really know what to think about it. Now, let's see. So I guess that is a common bug, because, I mean, 
there isn't really anything. I mean, I just picked the, the lower difficulty. Maybe they're just nuking themselves or something, making it easier. I don't know. But it is a little bit strange. Oh, this guy needs to get back to base and just regenerate a little bit. Because he's gonna die. I don't care about the Ultralisk. Hydralisk, I mean. Now, you guys are mining my minerals. Never mind. The minerals are not being mined. They're still attacking, even though they have no minerals, which I think is kind of strange. Shit. Oh, fuck me sideways. I don't have burrow research. Shit. Mineral field depleted. I need me look here right now. Yeah. Our forces are under attack. Oh fuck me! I have I have uh, carriers Our right flying towards me. There they are. Oh shit! This is not gonna hold. Mineral field oh, that is not gonna hold at all. Or is it? I could hold it off. I could definitely hold it off. Ah, oh, shit. Wrong thing. Ah, oh, god. I lost all my needles. Fuck me sideways. The hive cluster is under attack. Ah, shit. Well, derp. It's gonna get you air units. are starting to dwindle, so I'll just transfer all these guys over here, set you guys on my gas. Now this is starting to get a little bit tricky because I'm starting to run out of, out of resources, yet I have a lot of bases to destroy still, so the good thing is the enemy is now mining. Uh, as far as I remember, in the original StarCrafts, even if they were mining, they are only mining one mineral at a time, so that way if you destroy the base, you could still take it over. And obviously they always had the, the full resource capabilities. And the reason that was done is because they got free, free units basically. Oh shit, not this again. Right, I'll need to get... I don't see the nuclear launch. Still. Oh. They don't have nukes. Look at that. They don't have nukes. Impossible. They don't have a command center at all. So they can't possibly have a nuke. No wonder. Oh, they have one here, but it doesn't have a nuke attachment. Mineral field depleted. So suck a dick, Terrans, you don't have a nuke. That was that's a bug. Our forces are under attack. The hive cluster is under attack. Lots and lots of hydralisks. Oh shit. Um I need a bit of anti-air here. Oh yeah, yeah. Ultralisk. No! More overlords. Oh, look at you. Now 
I gotta destroy this base because this base is starting to cause me trouble with all those raids. I'll destroy this also. Oh shit, no, never mind. Now these units. They're too precious to lose to this shit. Alright, I'll also get attack level 1. Kill him. God, it's only one more unit. Attack the fucking drones here, like. Um, what am I doing? Lots of zerglings, hydralisks, maybe one or two ultralisks. Make it three. Make it four. Fuck it. I don't know. Yes, yes, I know, I'm always short on gas. Gas is like one of the most annoying things to get in the first few star points. Oh shit. That is why I couldn't take over that base last time. Fuck you, Terrans. Fuck you, Terrans. That's a lot of Zerglings incoming right now. I don't even know why I have Scourge in there, to be honest. I'm gonna keep these guys as backup. Oh, Jesus. Don't see it, don't care. Our forces are under attack. Our forces are under attack. The hive cluster is our forces are under attack. Did I just take a drone to attack that? Yes, I did. Get the fuck back. You ain't no warrior. No. Right, another production facility here. We'll take care of that now. Alright, let's go for more armor. Strange that there's a gas thing right in the middle there. You really have to do transport unit just to get that gas. That's kind of ridiculous. But I need gas, so I'm gonna do it. Get them drones. Oh, geez, not again.
These guys are pissing me off now. I'm gonna wipe this base out. Here, don't I? Not anymore. Shit. <laughs> this guy's probably bleeding to death. No, he's not. Strange enough. Our forces are under attack. Fuck off. Thank you. Ah, son of a bitch, you still saw it. Ah, it's gone. Now, the Terrans are the only ones that are being really problematic right now. So I think I'll have to take care of those next. First, All let's wipe these units out first. Oh, I can't move. And then I'll take over that base as well. There we go. Now, what else is there? Get hydralisks. It's a lot of hydralisks. We'll get attack range. No, not yet. Attack damage is better. And I'll get ultralisk plating as well. That'll be pretty handy right now. Seeing as I have a few ultralisks. Oh shit! Kill that noob. God, they have a lot of health. Remember in StarCraft 2, carriers were like so squishy, but then in, uh, in StarCraft 1, they're like so fucking tanky, it's ridiculous. Remember as well, if you had like four or five of them stacked together, it's like, ha, good luck killing it. <laughs> good luck with that one. Be there for three days trying to kill us. They're just throwing units at him. Oh shit. Get the tanks. Hey, don't go that far. Oh yeah, that, that, that one marine is going to do so much. Good job. Alright, I think I should expand. Seeing as this mineral line is about to run out. Oh shit. You should certainly be attacking these guys. I'm gonna so get stoned right now. Fuck me. I just did that end. Oh, it's not. Never mind. Go back. I should probably get some hydras to this group, shouldn't I? Let's make a move on with this group. I'm kind of scared there's going to be a reaver here, so I'm just going to send this guy. There we go. 
He'll probably kill it, to be honest. No, he's not. I don't need them backups. The high cluster is under attack. Ship rates. You certainly stay here. Oh, by the time they kill this thing, it'll be like two days. I did quite a lot of damage there, I destroyed all the defenses. But that is pretty much it for that. Oh shit, there's a shield there, I thought about that. Sure, there is no nuclear launch. Go do some damage. Let's wipe this fucking base out. It's about time it died. Uh, let's build hydralis and then Zerbinus. Our forces are under attack. Oh shit, this is problematic. Hey, where's my hydrolysis? There you are. You know what? There we go, six ultralisk on the way. Click, click. Ah, shit. One too many. You go here. Oh boy. I'm around on the minerals. All forces are under attack. Right, so this mission is pretty much almost over now. All I need is just a few more units, like these ones, and I should get this mission quite cleared. Oh, there's a lot of mines everywhere. Now the Protoss of course still exists, so they're not completely out of the game. I never built this. Under attack. Lots of stray units everywhere. Our forces are under attack. Lots oh, attacking me. Oh, I see. You run out of energy. I dare ya. I fucking dare ya. Look at you now. What are you gonna do now, huh, punk? Rebuild that. 
la 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 just walking true Let's get them for upgrades. I'd run out of energy before it kills this army and gives a shit. Just grab this guy and run straight in. You don't have nukes, bitch. No point in lying to me. You know, I should probably. Oh my god. Ultralisk. Hell, that's eight ultras on the way. Uh, General Duke is up here. Gotta take care of him in just a sec. Ah, what? They destroyed this? Son of a bitch. It's like my only mining base left. Oh, this one's the mining, okay. Oh, wow. Look at that, though. They're all pretty low. I'll just get wiped out right now. You ran into the wrong things, motherfuckers. Really into the wrong things. Our forces are under attack. Yeah, yeah, fuck you, ghost. Do. General Duke, you know I always wanted to have you killed. This is kind of exciting for me. Do your worst then, girl. You ain't taking Edmund Duke without a fight. And a fight you shall get. Get them Hydralisk rolling! This fucking ghost is a pest. And this is annoying. So tough now. <sighs> Fucking pricks. Let's try all my minerals. I have no minerals at all, really. Overlord, oh my god. 
so annoying. Just fucking kill Duke. You go fuck. Boom! That's one. Gergen, you murdering bitch. We had a deal. Oh, come on, Arcturus. Did you really think I'd allow you to come into power again? You practically fed me to the Zerg on Tarsonis. You're directly responsible for the hell I've been through. Did you honestly think I'd let you get away with that? But you said revenge was secondary to defeating the UED. I lied. I liberated this planet because it was the UED's primary staging point, not because I was under any obligation to you. I used you to destroy the Psy Disruptor. And now that I've got my broods back, you're no longer necessary for my plans. I think I'll leave you here, Arcturus, among the ashes of your precious dominion. I want you to live to see me rise to power, and I want you to always remember, in your most private moments, that it was you who turned me loose in the first place. Right, so that is Duke killed, as well as pretty much all of his base. I think there's only like a few items, I'll just kill them now. Are you serious? Not again! I have to defend this now, I can't let this die again. Yeah, it's gonna die anyways. Shit. Let it live, let it live. Oh yeah, why do you have to bottleneck yourself like that? Jesus Christ. This and this. Our forces are under attack. Evolution complete. Haha, <laughs> guess what happens now, bitch? He does one damage to the Ultralisk. I'm gonna hold him position here and I'm just gonna feed him to my ultralisk. I'm gonna feed the motherfucker. Being such a pest the whole time. Mineral field depleted. All forces are under attack. Evolution all forces are under attack. Right, I think that is it. Mineral field depleted. Mineral field depleted. Just go kill Phoenix. Phoenix is up here. This is a betrayal, most foul, Kerrigan. We were fools to have gone along with this charade. You're right, Phoenix. I used you to get the job done. And you played along just like I knew you would. You Protoss are also headstrong and predictable. You are your own worst enemies. That's ironic. I can remember Tassadar teaching you a very similar lesson on Char. I took that lesson to heart, Praetor. Now, are you ready to die a second time? The Kala awaits me, Kerrigan. And although I am prepared to face my destiny, You'll not find me easy prey. Actually, it's quite easy. That shall be your epitaph. Phoenix is a lot weaker than Duke. Duke has a whole fucking battleship. Oh, look, he has actually 800, 800. That was only 240. For some strange reason. There goes Phoenix. Our forces are under attack. Phoenix. No. What do you 
more worried about Jim. He died the way all Protoss hoped to. In combat. He died because you betrayed him. How many more noble souls do you need to consume before you're satisfied? How many more people need to die before you realize what you've become? You don't even know what you're talking about, Jim. Don't I? I'll see you dead for this, Kerrigan. For Phoenix, and all the others who got caught between you and your mad quest for power. Tough talk, Jimmy. But I don't think you have what it takes to be a killer. It may not be tomorrow, darling. It may not even happen with an army at my back. But rest assured, I'm the man who's gonna kill you someday. I'll be seeing you. Right, that is Mineral field. Phoenix. Now all I have to do is just destroy the bases, and that is pretty much it. I never got around to doing this, did I? Might as well, just, just for shits and giggles. But, uh, let's get crack and finish this off. Oh, shit. I need all my hydrisks to kill this. Our forces are under attack. Hydralisk power. Our forces are under attack. Right, I believe that is it. I think the mission should end right now. Now the reason I have these guys is for stealthers, by the way, in case you're wondering why I have a lot of warlords here. Because those ghosts really got on my nerves. And I think that is it. Yep, there it is. So that is that mission. Maybe there's gonna be cinematic of some sort. It is done, Cerebrit. They've all been destroyed. Let us return to Tarsonis to rest. For the first time since my transfiguration, I am wearied of the slaughter. Right, so that is that. Hope you enjoyed it. Do leave me any comments and feedback of any sort. Hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. I'm Vapo. Animal.